Nick speaking and welcome to this video right I thought it'd be a good idea to have a little follow-up video um, and a sort of review really of the KR multi case that I unboxed a few videos ago um, because it's quite interesting I did have a couple of comments asking me um, you know can we have a look see what how the minis fit in etc so I have my flayed cron army completely in here it's got a 2000 point army in here um, and in actual fact, I um, only use three of the four provided trays. There is a reason for that, which I'll show you in a minute. Uh, so continuing on, then opening up the lid, you have uh, obviously the foam top. And then in here I have my uh, 15 scarabs and my 25 warriors, they fit in there perfectly and although these do stick up there's plenty of foam to push them in and by the time you get the lid on there's you know there's absolutely no squashing at all um, of the models so that's the first layer, just put this down and then the second layer, just take that off I have all of my uh, or all two squads of flayed ones, so I have one unit there, one unit there. Um, it, there's enough room to get them in without squashing anything, but also so that the claws aren't actually poking up. So no claws are poking up, so they're not vulnerable at all. So that's that layer. And just going on to the last layer. Now because of my army having a few bigger uh, figures, that was one reason why I had to take one layer out and not use it. Um, which is great, I have a spare layer now for something else. Uh, but as you can see in here, I use an extra piece of foam. Um, I've got loads of spare foam, so I just used a piece of that. Um, and that's covering up the flayed ones, so 20 more flayed ones. And the reason why I put that in there is because I have these bigger models. I have the wraiths, so four wraiths sitting in there. Uh, another two here. I put them on the edges, so that when it, when with the foam on, when it lays down, it lays down nice and flat, and that was the reason why I had to take out the other layer, because uh, effectively this layer is taking up two layers. Uh, and then of course I have my Destroyer Lords Storm Tech in there as well, uh, not Storm Tech, um, Storm Lord. So there you go, that's it. So I've literally got my 2,000 point case in, I have army in the case. Um, like I said, I only use three of the four trays. Now, if it was all troops, of course, it would be um, very, very easy just to basically take these big ones out and have troops in there, then have another layer of troops. There'd be no issues at all. But yes, bear in mind, if you've got a few bigger models, um, you're probably going to have to lose one of the trays. Uh, so just bear that in mind. Okay, so yeah, that's my review. Uh, hopefully it's useful. And thanks for watching.